my. I hope I'm live because I can't see my camera, guys. So I have no idea. Okay. Thank you. I'm. All right. So. Facebook, oh, Facebook. It's a love and hate relationship with Facebook, isn't it? Um, I feel like I don't want to have the volume up on my um, iPad, but uh, it, uh, yeah, it's very weird. I usually can look at my phone and see things, but I can't because it won't let me do the little uh, turn the camera thing around. So I now have to have my iPad to see myself. Very weird, very strange. I don't know, Facebook is crazy. But happy Tuesday, everybody. I hope you guys have had a great week. Um, I uh, didn't. I did some stuff for work. We had a baby shower for a friend at work today. So I got to get a crafty with chocolates. Um, I made a little 3D chocolate bear, filled it full of stuff, and she cracked her bear open, and it was fun. It was fun to do something a little bit different. I'll have to uh, maybe post some pictures of my little bear creation. Um, and I made some peanut butter truffles. And I made homemade um, gummy bears. So I was very excited about that. It was like a three day process, really needs to be a little more than three days. Um, but it was all the time I had because I had to order citric acid off Amazon. So which I'm wanting to make these for Christmas. I'm kind of debating on that now because they were a process. You had to set them all up on their little butts and then lay them sideways. And then it, 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 I envy people who do that all the time. I used to do some baking, hence the name Shanna Sweets, um, but I don't want to do that. But I do plan on doing some for Christmas, so maybe I'll post some of those kind of pictures um, when I get around to doing that this uh, fall, this uh, holiday season. So there's um, going to be some exciting things coming up um, in the Stampin' Up! world. I got a little sneak peek. Um, this morning they're going to be having a sale later um, I think they usually do something closer for like Black Friday but they're gonna do it mid-September um, so that will be coming out I want to say it was around the 16th so I'll be posting that um, if you're on my email list that's where it's probably gonna go first um, so make sure I'll put a link down after this is over to sign up on my email list because that's where it's gonna go um, I will be working on my email list later on, probably tonight or maybe in the morning. Um, I will be sending out my um, my class. Next class is posted on this page already. I believe yesterday it posted for Sweet Little Stocking. Um, that is, and then I posted the tutorial should have also posted on this page yesterday for um, my November Sweet Treat. So that has posted, that is a free tutorial. Um, the video is free, but the card kit is free to customers. So if you purchase $25 or more, then you get the actual card kit. But the tutorial is free to anybody who wants to watch the video. Um, you can see that. And then the actual written instructions is on my blog itself. Um, so the link, on here will lead you to my blog so those things and then I um, am working later this I'm off for a couple days and then I work the weekend and then I'm off for a week yes I'm going to be on vacation again and I am doing convention next week so I'm home so that I can our convention is virtual this year and I am taking off next week um, I have a retreat day with my upline and then three days of Stampin' Up! Um, and then I have a craft show on Saturday in Eureka. 
So I will be doing my Tuesday Facebook Live. Um, but then I will be in Eureka on Saturday. If anybody is in that area, they are going to have three different buildings this year. Three of them. Can you even believe it? She said there's over a hundred and some vendors that's going to be at this show. Um, very excited. I've done this show. Oh my gosh. I don't even know how many years now, like four years, I think it's a wonderful show. Char um, Charlene, I think she, she always puts on a great show. She has raffles and every building is going to have a separate raffle. So the more vendors you buy from at each building, the more tickets you get to put in each um, raffle. So um, it's a really, really nice show. Um, and I look forward to uh, participating in that. Um, my daughter has worked really hard and um, helping me prepare product this year so and she doesn't know it but she's I got some things I want her to work on this week um, to start getting ready for some Christmas presents so that's what I'm gonna have her working on now so tonight we're not even gonna do Christmas we're gonna do a birthday card yeah I'm gonna break I'm gonna take a little break um, although I'm gonna start working on some Christmas stuff too but I thought I had this project um, on my desk for a little while and I thought we would do it. Um, we're going to use some paper that I think people might have forgot is available. Um, it's available as a hostess gift. So you do have to spend or get your friends to spend with you because you can do that if you wanted to set up as a workshop. And I definitely can set you up as a workshop. So it's not like you have to pay for your friend's stuff. I can set it up where your friends pay for themselves. Um, but you guys can go together. But they have this great paper and it's called Pattern Party Designer Series Paper and it is a total of 48 sheets of paper. And you get, um, I forgot how many designs. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, twelve. 12. So 12 designs of paper. So, and like one side is black and white. Hopefully I'm in the camera. So those are all black and white. And then the front, so it's gonna go this way. The front is all these bright, colorful, um, different designs. So you get a lot, a lot of papers. This is like my second pack. Um, and it's like, and it's on page, oops, just two ribbon. So it's on page 171. Yeah, it says for each of 12 double-sided designs. And it's $18, a $30 value. So, why do I look frozen on that screen? I hope I'm not really frozen. Oh, Facebook, Facebook, Facebook. So, um, so yeah, so it is um, $18. That is a whole lot of paper. And that's what I'm going to use tonight. And I really love it. I really, I love the stripes is one of my favorites. And here I got another piece. This is my other really favorite. This sheet right here, right there. Look at those hearts. That's my other favorite. So tonight we are going to use Pampered Pets. This is my daughter's favorite stamp set. On my, well, one of her favorites. That girl, oh my gosh. If I'm not bad enough, that girl is like... And then this one here is one of my favorites too. I really, really like this sentiment stamp set. So, okay, I'm going to try to turn you down. Hopefully, smoothly. All right, so we're going to use this guy. Can you see him? Okay. So I'm going to, um, I'm going to go ahead and get out my little stampin' mat here because you don't really have to use it for this guy, but, and I have a stitch scallop 
uh, basic white already. And we're just going to go ahead and ink this guy. Actually, you know what? Before we ink our guy up, we're going to stamp our birthday because we want to um, stamp him above it. So I'm going to get some Bermuda Bay. And actually, you could do it in any color, but I really like I'm going to use these dots. And this is pool party, but I feel like the Bermuda Bay stands out better. So I'm going to stamp the birthday right across the bottom. And that's why I'm using the mat because the birthday is um, photopolymer. Then I can stamp my doggy. And then he's going to go right here above my birthday. All right. And then I just have a blend, and I'm just going to use the pointy end here and color his little collar. And this is just a real red. And then I actually have a black one out because I'm going to color his nose. And that's all. I'm not going to do a bunch of coloring on this. I'm just going to do that little bit. And then I've already cut out, this is a happy, and this is out of this die set. So this is just the word wishes dies. That's mainly um, holidays, but I like the happy in there. I have some real red cardstock, and this measures seven by five and a half, and it is scored at two and three quarters. Okay, and then I have some white, and the white is three and a quarter by five and a quarter. And I'm just going to put this on the inside to the score mark. And then my pool party bubbly side here. This is one and a quarter by five and a quarter. So see, and then my stripes is um, two and three quarters by five and a quarter. So it's just going to go on this side. And then this is just going to go. And then I need to poke out my little bits here. And then get just a little bit of glue. And put my happy and I mean you could jazz it up more if you wanted but I like it like this I think it's great just simple now I have two birthday cards right there so that's it that's a simple card I'm making tonight guys I hope you like that and I hope um, to do get caught up on a bunch of things while I'm off work. <sighs> I always say that, but it never happens. So I'm really keeping my fingers crossed this time. 
So thank you guys so much. If there's anything you want to see, please let me know down below. I would appreciate it. Um, I'm going to have some challenges that I'm going to work on with these retreats that I'm working on and some other projects, but I definitely would like um, any thoughts on what you'd like to see coming up, especially with the new year. I'm making plans on what all to do. So thank you so much, and I will talk to you all later. Have a great day. Bye.